Hello there everybody, it's Tykatar here, and welcome back to episode 4 of Tygeria. So, I have been, uh, it's been quite some time since our last episode, and I've been working quite a bit on this project. So, I am very happy to announce that Are You Smarter Than The Guide is complete in its first form here at least. I've spent well over 60 hours over the last week and a half or so on this project and I'm super excited about it and super happy to share it with all of you guys now. So let's just get into that. So here's the world, this is Tigaria that we're on and I've done some terraforming here. I actually spent like literally 10 minutes today, maybe blasting out a bit of a hole here with the new endgame technology, it is just outstanding how much dirt you can destroy basically instantly. Like this whole cavity, I just blew up in like five minutes. It was awesome. And then anyway, I got started on a little bit of the uh, block palette and um, design for the future base itself and how the main structure might start to take form. And so I wanted to just get some idea of kind of the, the general theme that I wanted to go for set up here. So as of releasing this video, I have uploaded this world to the Steam Workshop, so you should be able to find it there. And I will also include it in a link in the description under just a world download file from Google Drive. So you can do it either way. You can manually copy the world in or you can get it off the Steam Workshop. Same with actually Circa Terra. I have gone through and updated Circa Terra and made sure that it is all fixed up and have that world now for available for transport on the Steam Workshop. So I'm pretty happy about that. But with any further ado, I just want to show you a quick little tour of the interface and what it looks like. So I just had a bunch of my cousins and friends on with me to test it out with me and to see kind of just how the game works, if it functions properly or what kind of went wrong with it. And so my original plan was to just have them come on and I would show them exploring the interface and kind of explain it that way. But immediately they all teleported over there and started running around. Most of them just ignored all of the signs and then started asking me what to do instead of reading the signs that I tried to explain what to do on. So I thought it'd be easier just to do a little explanation and run through of it myself here so that it's easier for you guys to see. And then I'll share some clips from our session earlier because it was pretty fun. So let's head over there. I got a, a sign here that says flip the switch to teleport to the game. So you teleport and bam, here we are. So you teleport to the main game interface and there are these signs right where you start that sort of explain what to do. So let's just start by reading the signs. Are you smarter than the guide? Welcome to a Terraria trivia game. Discover and contemplate over 150 different questions spread across four categories, or difficulty levels rather, same thing. All questions pertain to the current 1.4.2 PC version of Terraria. Questions about different updates will be clearly stated. Please note the signs to the left. Feel free to set your spawn at the bed and then explore the difficulty options. So we got a nice bed right down here in this little room here. You can set your spawn here so that you can teleport back to the game start instead of world spawn. So let's take a look at these signs. This sign again just repeats the other one in case you missed it. So the first sign, suggested take item. If you don't already have one or have an item of similar function, feel free to take one from the barrel below. This is of course referring to the magic mirror. So I actually put all of the magic mirrors that I collected from mining out this whole world in this uh, in that barrel there. So you can grab one that actually came from this world. So that's kind of fun. We already have our cell phone on, so we don't have to worry about that. Next sign, suggested leave items. Please leave all wiring tools slash accessories out of your inventory and off your person. Also leave any mechanisms such as traps or pressure plates feel free to store them in your piggy bank until you're finished playing. And there's a piggy bank right down below here. You can put your stuff in if it's not full of junk like mine is. And it, very importantly, if you have a guide to critter companionship on hand, be sure to put that away, otherwise the game will break. Now this is because 
all of the questions and the interface require uh, or use rather goldfish statues to randomize the location to that teleports you to give the game variation. So if you have your guide to critter companionship on, the game will not function properly and you'll just keep getting teleported back and forth because the goldfish aren't dying when they should. So that's basically the all you need to know about the game. There are different uh, pieces of interesting furniture hanging all around and I just realized I have my specter goggles on so things look a little bit weird. I basically just tried to add all kinds of decorations to make you make it look weird basically. I wanted to use all my tricks that I know to make weird looking furniture items, floating furniture, all this funny stuff to really get you in the mood for trivia and all the weird things that you can do in this game. So let's just quickly explore the different categories. So we've got classic. You'll have to answer eight questions correctly to make it through. Anyone who's played through the game once should be able to find their way through sooner or later. If you want to study up, grab a hollow book from the hollow bookcase on the left. Next we have the expert category. This category is meant to test even the more experienced players. Few questions are guaranteed to be easy. You'll have to come up with 13 correct answers in order to reach the other side. Do you like spikes? Just wondering. And then, of course, there is the master category. And then down here, we have the path leading to extreme meatballs. There's a sign as you approach that says, beware as you approach. The path is dangerous, not for the faint of heart. Continuing is not recommended, except for those who are extraordinarily courageous. And as you get up here, another sign says extreme meatballs and it explains the the questions a little bit better should you continue on this path you will not be able to turn back however so be careful with this one notice how there's no switch and sign on the teleporter like the others have that should be all you need to know about are you smarter than the guide in order to jump in and try it out for yourself if you're interested so without further ado Let's jump into some of those crazy clips that I got earlier with some of my so-called friends. I'm just starting it up now. What the heck? Can I, join the Steam? Can I go to the bathroom real quick? Yeah. No. That is that is technically not allowed. I heard I did I heard multiple responses. Who All said... of them no. All of them said no. This is a consensus. <laughs> okay, I, I had the best character in the game. Uh, nice, nice, nice hair. <laughs> Hello. Oh man, we got the red man. This is so this is still under construction here. I just I just did this today actually. How are you at like low health already? <laughs> you logged off at 100 HP. Dude, I was done with it. <laughs> I'm not dying here. I'm getting the heck out. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't need a new character. You can right. you can be any character. A new character is fine though. Who's the red man? I am the red man. Oh shoot! Join green, red man. I did. <laughs> He's on green. Right. Anyway, I, if you guys are ready, let's go ahead and meet down on the on spawn again. Like <laughs> at you. where you started the where you oh, recall yeah. to, if you recall. Ah, I see. Down here. Awesome. I don't have a recall button. Yeah, you don't need owl. to. You don't need one. I'll I'll get oh. you one in a second. All right, are you guys ready? Are you smarter <laughs> than the guide? Yeah, stop what? magic mirroring because you're leaving. Oh, oh I so, left it. Here's the interface. Here? Okay, use you... the switch on the teleporter. <laughs> no, Sorry. it pulled me back. Yeah, everyone <laughs> else has to get <laughs> off the teleporter. Get out of here. Dude, I literally <laughs> thought about that as being an issue. This is the main game interface. There are some signs down here oh, to explain God. a couple things. Wait, how do we start this game? Do I click something to start? Oh no, wait, why did I just grab something? I clicked the book by accident. Let me fix that. How do you fix this? Yeah, dude, I did the same thing and I tried to put it back and then I broke what it was sitting on and then I yeah. actually threw it. There's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of stuff that you could break, but don't worry about it because I have I made a backup literally five minutes ago. Did everyone read the sides at the beginning? Oh yeah, oh, read. Read. guys, reading is important. Where do we start I though? I can't though? read and I'm stuck in a box. I did. did. Hey, where do we start from, though? Is this Please get here? all wiring tools slash accessories out of oh, your inventory no, and off of your person. Good question. How do we start this game? Um, so, did you read all the signs? Yeah. I'm reading through them. I'm educated. Um, okay. okay. So, let's start with classic. Do -do -do. So, did you, grab, did you grab a magic mirror? Yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, perfect. Wait, is this classic? Yeah, so yeah. that's the classic Pull the one. lever, Kronk. The sign tells you, like, what it is and what... Aha, I am as smart as the Oh, so you just move right. You just keep going oh, right. Oh, man. Somebody already made it through. Wait, how do you start this? Write a hollow book? <laughs> Did he send you both down? Why are the... Why are there attorney yeah. crystals here? Did I forget to fill that sign in? Oh no! Uh oh. Did somebody make Wait. it? <laughs> no! <laughs> what are these questions? This is the easiest question? Let me out! <laughs> yeah, the, that's the classic questions. <laughs> How did I get oh, fishing no. pole wrong? Oh, I never. Oh, I got the first question wrong, anything. dude. It's a classic. Oh man, you couldn't even get the first one right. Oh, why did you make these questions, dude? They, they're not that hard. You forgot how they're reading because I was halfway through. <laughs> <laughs> well, halfway through, I forgot. Wait, somebody was incinerated? I may have. He <laughs> was dying. I can't get any questions right. I've oh only boy, I couldn't even get the uh -oh. first question right. <laughs> I've met my question. Alright, take two. Oh. I thought I got right. one right. Sand. <laughs> what? Uh, uh oh. Why would I know? A cooking pot? Alright, take two. I thought All I right. got one right. Sand. <laughs> what? Uh, uh oh. <laughs> Whoa, oh no, palm trees! Oh no! <laughs> Why am I just in space? What's happening? Hey! I think you glitched my game. Why am I. Did you put me in space? <laughs> You're in the top right, dude. <laughs> Why did you do that? Is that supposed to happen? <laughs> <laughs> yes, that is supposed to happen. <laughs> Why? Is this <laughs> <laughs> you need the magic mirror now. Yeah, yeah, that's why you need a magic mirror. Okay, so <laughs> I'm down. I don't even why? deserve a cool death. That's just why rude. <laughs> you got the first one wrong. I'm on a freaking shit. No, I got anything wrong again. <laughs> okay, you know what? Clear, clearly, expert is just too easy to me. That's why I can't do it. Let's go to master. <laughs> <laughs> so, you'll be stuck in a loop until the goldfish die. I I did, the second one, I did the first one. one. I did the first one right on the first try. Wait, how do you? Wait, where's the switch for this one? You activated it. What? Uh, what? Are, what? These are the questions. Five yeah, otherwise, I don't think it's sitting ducks. Sitting ducks is like forty or forty-five, I think. So, mechanics maybe. Fiberglass. Oh, mechanics. This. If we die, you can blame me. That's all right. Let's go. Ooh, oh, got... we made it. Yeah. When does the witch doctor sell the beautiful? That's kind of funny that you did that. How, was it a pain to put those there? I didn't guess it's after the um, like, It wasn't it? actually bad at all. No! Okay. Ah, I died from zombies. I have the failed us, I'm afraid. I am we fish. Are both oh, oh, so uh, you can just flip the switch at spawn and it teleports you back to the quiz area. Oh my god. <laughs> ah! It put me straight into the lava! Master. What? These questions are insane in the last one. That's the, the that's the extreme questions. What do you expect? I said that be extreme. Well, oh, you got set to the uncomfortable corner. One, two, three, four, five, six. What the heck is that? I'm going back to the hard ones. The other ones are boring. Oh, Wait, so what's Blaze Rod doing? He's out of the boxes. <laughs> I'm trying to go back. I can't go back. Wait, do you not have a magic mirror? Yeah, but that sends me too far. He sends me to spawn, not to the quiz area. Oh, oh, so... Yeah, uh, you can just flip the switch at spawn, and it teleports you back to the quiz area. Oh my god. You activated it. Oh, Damn, cool. Aaron, you- Oh <laughs> no! Mm -hmm. No. You're going to get the expert. I've honestly only <laughs> gotten to what, two Dang it! I, I died every time, so far. Oh, oh, that would take oh, so much oh. time to do that, I just realized. Going back. <laughs> There are honestly like too many messages from all my stupid sides <laughs> with this many people. <laughs> okay, everyone want a teleporter. I will pull the pull the switch. Yeah, Is everyone right. ready? Yeah. No! Oh, sorry, it's too late. Yeah, so now Dude, we're how'd you not together. hear this conversation? I don't want to do this. Wait, I Wait, how are we oh doing this? We did it! Oh, Ladies and gentlemen! Did we did it? <laughs> no. Yep, it was all I did it, yay! Spammy the random spawn. What the hell? <laughs> figure that one out. You may want to consult the guide with any further questions. That was, that was getting it wrong. Oh, you. <laughs> you want to join us on this one again? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I can make it there alive. I can't jump. <laughs> Why don't I have wings? Where's my wings? Alright. 
Everyone's present and accounted for. All right. right, first question. Which of these materials are the other ones? What the bloody <laughs> hell? <laughs> Which of these is not a material? Oh my god, how many different consumables are stored? Because I'm pretty sure the other two wait. are. The, oh, wait, the it's just uh oh, ah, oh wait. Oh, no. um, one of the issues with the game is it breaks during a blood moon. Why? <laughs> <laughs> because. Ah! Uh, I believe that's the Finch staff. Oh, just... <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, God. It was the same question. I believe it's the rune hat. <laughs> I still got it wrong. I apologize. Wait, did, you put, did you select green, oh, green cap or what? What? Enough. I don't think it was... You know what? I'm going copper axe. No, pickaxe. <laughs> Wait, you didn't create a PvP it. arena with items, so you can just pick up things. Well, that's down the road. We're doing trivia today. Are you smarter than the guy? <laughs> Why haven't you made every game mode again? <laughs> well, well, well. Wasn't that fun and uh, maybe a little bit chaotic. <laughs> I had a great time with those guys, although things definitely went pretty crazy. It was super awesome testing it out with them. Everything worked okay, I'd say. The... Some of the statues started going a little bit crazy. We had a few too many people pulling too many buttons at the same time and pushing all the switches other way around, but you know what I mean. And so it was really awesome getting to play with them. I hope that there are some of you out there who are interested in trying it out for yourselves. So feel free to find it on the workshop or download it from the link below. If you have any troubles with it or have any questions about it, please let me know and I'll be happy to work with you and try to get them figured out. And that is going to do it for the fourth episode of Tigeria. I really hope you enjoyed it. I hope it wasn't too overwhelming or crazy for you. And with that, the song of the episode is going to be Let It Whip by Daz Band. Super duper groovy, just a fun song to move around to. I hope you all have an outstanding rest of your day and thank you so very, very much for watching.